Matt, it is a big day in reopening South Florida with Miami's historic Domino Park returning to normal. We all know it's a popular place to play a game of dominoes and local 10 News reporter Hatzel Vela is live to tell us about the celebration today. And Hatzel, a lot of people have been waiting for this park to reopen. Yeah, Janice, think about this. This park has been closed since March of last year and you know what this means for a lot of these folks in this community this is bringing a sense of normalcy you can see it for yourself uh, the first day that domino park is now reopened you can see folks taking advantage of it we talked to some of these folks and they're telling us listen we have been without access to this for more than a year now and they tell you this is their livelihood this is what they do on a daily basis these are folks that they don't just live in this community they come from all over uh, Miami to do this and partake in what's obviously a historically uh, popular game uh, especially for folks in Cuban American community we talked to Commissioner Joe Carroyo, former Mayor Carroyo, who tells us not only does this show that this there's a light at the end of the tunnel, but it also brings back uh, some the economy aspect of it, right? When we talk about tourism, he says this is important because it is something that folks look forward to when it comes to coming to Miami and visiting Little Havana. This park here is extremely important that we open it, not because it's one of the most used parks of any in the city of Miami and greater Miami. But this is a major tourist attraction that the tourists would come here, they would uh, get something to eat, they would buy something in a souvenir store, and then they would come and uh, enjoy the uh, elderly playing dominoes. <laughs> And an extra component to this whole reopening of Domino's Park is the fact that you could come here and now get vaccinated, especially for these elderly folks who come here and partake in some of this uh, domino playing. There's a CVS tent just right next door and they're giving vaccines uh, for anybody who wants to get vaccinated. And so obviously the emphasis here is doing this, but staying safe. And you can see back out live that not every table is going to be open for uh, playing. So you have one table open, one table that's not opened. Uh, that way folks can socially distance, uh, be re remain socially distanced, and also they have to wear their masks. So again, a huge day in the city of Miami, especially here in the little Havana neighborhood, because you know this is such an iconic place and it has now reopened. Christy, Janice? Yeah, it's so good to see that hat. So I know so many people were waiting for it. And man, just makes you want to go play a nice game of dominoes right now. <laughs>